very modest aim. We want to change the world. We want to change the way humanitarians do their work. We want to um, upscale the skills of the entire sector. We want to engage uh, with the major issues of humanitarian aid. HCRI is engaging with all these issues and we want to, we want to actually be a genuine partner and a co-producers with the humanitarian sector of a different future. With HCRI, we have medical doctors next to political scientists. We have people from a gender studies background. We have people with an expertise on disasters. We have historians. So it is genuinely not just across departments, but it's actually across faculties within the university. Well, I think definitely uh, one of the best resources is our good staff members and the expertise that is in Manchester. I mean, books you can borrow basically from everywhere, but um, getting the people who have the knowledge and um, the different opinions and perspectives together in one place, that's quite unique. Yeah, it's, it's definitely unique. I mean, there's other places that may focus strictly on classroom learning and theory and this uh, institute is attempting to put those theories into practice. We run as part of our MA class in peace building and annual field work. Um, I've organized this twice already and um, both times I went with my students to Cyprus. The field work experience is quite nice for the students because it takes them out of the classroom um, and brings a bit of reality to all the literature you're reading. We want to use these as a chance to get away from the notion of a field trip being conflict tourism, going through the ethics and the practicalities of the research. So UK Med um, uh, signed an MOU with uh, HCRI about a year ago or so, and this created a partnership um, between like, an operational body and this academic and research institute which is supported by healthcare professionals, sociologists, historians, uh, politicians, anthropologists, um, so a whole host of backgrounds. Yeah, Manchester uh, obviously has a reputation as a very forward-thinking, gritty sort of city, and I thought what better place to study peace and uh, try and create some form of justice and, in the world than uh, Manchester. To be so close to action while remaining an academic is brilliant. I feel like I'm doing um, exactly the work I wanted to do and it's a great opportunity. I mean, not many people can say that about their life. Doing what you like and with passion I think is, is fantastic.